Asalaamu Alaikum everyone. Okay, so Kespa is quite bullish here, 65 area, 0 0.065. And uh, the technical target, one technical target is already met at the 61, which was given a way long time ago. And now you do have this second technical target all the way up to 0 0.072. Now keep in mind that uh, this is where if you do actually, I do believe that, you know, the plan here is to literally probably just touch this technical target and probably get rejected, get hammered here and then finally drop down to this uh, area because once you break above here this pattern you haven't really back tested this line over there so in the future whether you actually start to dump from here or whether you dump from that technical target uh, there will be a correction happening and I'm pretty sure that anybody who knows trading understands that this right now the prices are literally high and uh, the RSI is probably looking to get a little bit higher all the way up here. So you do have a small room for a pump. So I do believe that once you get up to this technical target, wherever you go, who knows, make a little bit of a blow. But in the future, in the future, there is uh, a retracement coming down because there was no a time where cash pumped without correcting it. Pumped here, corrected down, pumped again, correction, pumped again, and a correction. You pump again, and a correction you pump here and probably another correction and this is totally fine you know having uh pushes up like that is always amazing for any coin you know it, it just shows that how good of a coin this is for trading basically now i may start to buy again if it does come down here because this is the main retest that we may be looking forward to and that's going to be 0 0.052256 so if it does come down there, this is a place where there could be, um, you know, this is a good candidate of a buying bid right there. So that's the daily. And what about the four hour time frame? Let's see if you have any continuation pattern. Okay, so I'm just going to leave you with this. And uh, we do have a flag here. So this flag or probably can be more visible on a one hour time frame. So if you have some sort of a flag or perhaps this is going to be good on the three hour time frame, I guess. Yes, three hour time frame looks better. So let's just say that could, you could be looking for another technical target from there to there and actually it's a little bit higher so we, we may be talking about uh, 0 0.0777 something so that's going to be a move of nearly from there to there this is going to be a, another 17 percent move to the upside so 17 percent move uh, is the maximum that i think is going to happen and uh, from there if you do come down for the retest it's almost like a 32 percent move down because you know corrections are always going to happen somewhere down in the future like higher chances of course of correction to happen and that's it for the, the update on caspa right now and do help me reach 100k and i'm going to see you the next one i love you